Hello, this is Donnie with RV360 Tips, and today I'm just going to go over if you have a Jayco Command Center, and this is something that we just recently updated our software, and it takes about 45 seconds, and what you'll need is a hotspot or Wi-Fi or just the internet. Um, I actually had to use my hotspot on my phone to update it because we didn't have Wi-Fi, and just kind of go over how, how we do that. We got a message on our main page. To the right hand corner where the Bluetooth symbol is, a yellow button that states to update your J command travel slash travel links. And all you do is go into your market store, type in the J command slash travel links, and it'll pull it up and it'll update. You'll see it, and it takes about 45 seconds. And then once that's done, completed, you'll go back to your main page. And you'll see the yellow button missing. And to kind of go over our command uh, page here to help people out if it's helping. One thing, if you ever need to uh, reboot your software or your uh, um, iPad, there is a actually right under this left arrow underneath is a pinhole size. And you can do a paper clip or a pen to push up underneath here. It's very underneath the edge. And it'll reset itself if you ever need to do that. And there's other things that will help is you have your home page, you have your air conditioning. And the second page you have your water. Next page is going to be your um, auto leveling. You can manually do that. And what you see on your screen, you can do on your phone, on your J command app. Your awnings, your slides, you can move them in and out. You have your temperature, which is going to be your air conditionings. We have two of them. And then your lighting. You have your bedroom, dinette, awning, entry. And it's the same thing like anywhere else on your phone. You just turn it on, turn it off. And you slide it, adjust it, make it darker or lighter. And then the next one is sensors. If you have tire sensors, BM Pro sensors, uh, propane, uh, maybe temperature for your refrigerator. You can do that. Now we do have solar. We have Go Power. We have two solar panels. And this shows what we have coming in. 15.5 current. And it has a history of what you're using. And you can clear that out. And your inverters are on here. If you're boondocking, you need to convert over. You can. You just click on that. It'll turn on. And one little trick, too, that some people don't know if you're uh, having trouble scrolling at times, go into your administration tab, and you can actually go into here to pull down and go into administration and change the font on your screen if you need it larger or smaller. But if you get it too large, you'd have trouble scrolling. So this is um, some information. I hope it helps. And this is Donnie with RV360 Tips. Thank you for watching.